Welcome back. Today is the second day that I'm doing Vlogmas. I'm not very good at this whole Vlogmas thing, obviously. I work like three jobs and I just don't have time to film all the time because I work. Today is gonna be kind of fun. So I don't have a whole lot of money to work with here, but I wanna decorate my apartment for Christmas. So I'm gonna go to Dollar Tree and see if they have any like cute stuff and I mean I have gotten like all of my Halloween decorate all of my like Halloween decorations from there and stuff so it shouldn't be an awful ow I <laughs> just ran into the wall <laughs> so it shouldn't be an awful selection so we're just gonna go and see what they've got this is the outfit for the day I got this really cute scarf from I believe Walmart like a few Christmases ago and I have another one and it's like literally the exact same but it is like red and cute um and then I, this off the shoulder black top that I wear all the time and then these jeans are from Kohl's and the black furry boots that I was wearing in my Vlogmas day one. My new signature hairstyle <laughs> is like this updo, I guess, with like my hair down in front. I just think it like adds some volume to my hair. And then I put my hair in braids last night, so in a braid last night, and it came out like really cute after I took it out. So I just left it. And yeah, so I'm gonna go to the store now. I am from Michigan. This is not how I'm supposed to dress. I am literally in a jacket and a scarf. And I was thinking to myself, I'm not wearing this because it's cold. It's 64 degrees. I'm not wearing this because it's cold. I'm wearing it because it's a fashion statement. So, a Michigan girl in California, 64 degree weather, um, this is what I've come to. I feel like every time, every time I get in my car, I have like some like life altering like thoughts. <laughs> I'm going to go to the store and we'll see what we can find. Rocking around the Christmas tree at the Christmas party hop. well um it's a good it's a good start i only spent like 14 dollars so um yeah and i got two bags well i did get stuff for my friends so that doesn't count as christmas decorations but i'll show you what i got when i get home okay so before i go home i'm going to stop by this event thing and it's um a golden let me look up exactly what it's called it's this golden girls thing and i'm in love with the golden girls so like why would i not go it's an eve it's called an evening with the golden girls and cheesecake <laughs> with writer rick cup and for dessert they have special golden girls cheesecake <sighs> i'm super excited um i'm gonna get some footage of that and then I'll do my Christmas decor haul when I get home. So that's what I'm doing for the rest of the night.
Okay, so I went, excuse you. I went to two stores. I went to Dollar Tree and got a lot of like Christmas decorations type of stuff. And then I also went to Target and got a few things for me because I literally only went there for cookies and that just, you know, you go to Target and you get things that, you know, Target tells you what you want. From Dollar Tree, I wanted to like decorate my door for Christmas, but like I didn't want to spend $25 on a wreath because I'm just going to take it down in like a month anyway. So I got this and then i also got this really cute sparkly bow and then i got some tinsel garland um and i'm gonna think i'm gonna put it around my entertain my tv my entertainment center and i think it'll just like look really really cute and make it actually feel like christmasly up over there oh my god laura you're so cute and then i'm planning on making christmas cookies wow that garland in there is glitter uh, everywhere oh my god oh my god i ordered my coffee table how do you how, how do you even bend like that i don't understand how cats spines okay morai that's just creepy okay she's weird anyways i'm making i'm planning on making christmas cookies so i got a bunch of containers for those since I don't have like a whole lot of money to just get gifts, like personalized gifts for people, I feel that it's nice to at least make something and I love making cookies and I would love to get cookies as a gift because they're great and they're yummy. I mean, as long as you don't like poison them or make them awfully. So I'm gonna make my friends Christmas cookies as presents. <sighs> okay, so like I'm telling my friends that I am getting them something. So like I I know that I can't leave for Christmas, so I wanna make sure that like everyone's gonna be here so I can give them to them. But then I don't wanna be like, oh yeah, well, um, your gift will only last so long, so I can't just like mail it to you or leave it at your house. So you actually need to be there. <laughs> so I can't just like tell them and then they're thinking that they're gonna like get something like other than cookies. And I'm just like, not happening. But I make really good cookies. So it's the thought that counts, okay? And then like, what if they don't want cookies? If you don't want the gift that I am giving you, then bye. Christmas of 2016 was my last Christmas that I was still living in Michigan and I went to Dollar Tree and I picked up these really cute like Christmas containers but they were like really cute and Christmas decorated but this year oh my god they had these ones that looked like little mailboxes but they were like the tin kind and then they had a little flag and like if my friend wasn't like home when I was like dropping off the Christmas cookies I was like oh I could put like up the little like flag and be like oh you have mail and then you open it and there's cookies and I'm like oh that would be so cute but then I was like but then I want something that they're going to be able to use like even like after like they're done with the cookies. So I just figured that these are going to be like really, really cute. And this one has like really cute like little trailers on it and like a truck. And, oh, and this one is Santa's house, Santa's house, North Pole airmail. Like how cute is this? And it has like little envelopes on the side. This is so cute. This one's got like Christmas trees on it and then just like writing around the side. Dollar Tree is so underrated. Then this one is really cute. It says comfort and joy and it's got like little like mugs across it. So those are really cute. I only got five, one, one, two, three, four, five for right now. because I don't know how many of my friends are gonna be in town. So I don't know who I'm gonna be able to give them to, but um, I'm not gonna give it on Christmas or like near Christmas. It's gonna be like a little bit before just because people go out of town and I am making cookies. So I wanna be able to like actually give them to people. I got, a red and a green sparkly ribbon so that I can tie like little bows on top. 
Morai, I have things in there. Why are you so obsessed with bags? You are so weird. So then, then I went to Target. The real reason why I went to Target was because I've been seeing people eating these cookies and I wanted them so bad. And they're like the cook, okay, all cookies are really good, you know, raw. But these cookies, these cookies, the Pillsbury cookies, oh. And then I also bought these two movies because I don't have any Christmas movies and these also are not on like any streaming platform anywhere. So got those. And then I also got these, um, LED lights that I'm going to put in the tinsel on my entertainment center. And last but not least, I got the best thing in the entire world. <sighs> Reese's trees. It literally any holiday shaped Reese's cup is tastes different than a regular one. So I think I'm going to be ending the vlog here. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and happy vlogmas y'all.